Yo, hello again there friends and fans, Raptor here, chat, what's going on? Good to see you all here for some Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2, the second one. I actually remember uh, that I played the first one. I didn't play that uh, again since 2018, so it's been, uh, it's been a day or two. You know, it's been a little bit since we played one of these types of games. But uh, actually, there's a uh, another reason um, that I want to play this game today is because they're coming out with a new... Uh, hunter game, Hunter Call of the Wild, except they call it the Angler Call of the Wild, so uh, unrelated to this game, but still in the realm of fishing. That game seems like it's going to be an open world fishing simulator, where you literally get a truck and you can drive around to different locations on the map, but this one, I think, gets you just straight right to where you're supposed to be, you know, like on the side of a lake or a pond or wherever, and we're going to go fishing, so we'll see how it goes. It'll be good times, so welcome aboard. Gone fishing, brother. Tan, good to see you. Welcome back. Hello there, uh, Michael. Good to see you as well. Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go fishing. I've done a lot of fishing in my life. I have uh, enjoyed. I've been a while since I've gone, but I've enjoyed it. And uh, it's always nice when we get to play a fishing game. Every game, by the way, that's like a survival RPG or like a cutesy top-down, like Stardew Valley or whatnot. All these games have like fishing mini games. Not all of them have hunting games, but every single one of them have a fishing game where it's like, you know, you put your bobber in the water and you just wait and then you, you know, spash, spa, space or whatever until the fish is brought back and there you go. Oh boy. But we'll see how uh, this game is and we'll see how the other ones upcoming are too. So it should be a good time. Good time indeed. All right, let's go ahead and create a profile and we'll get started. This game uh, out now on Steam. I don't, is this on um, Game Pass too? I'm not even sure. Normal, realistic, or sandbox? Uh, let's go with normal. What the hell is that? Oh, I think... Wait. I think that's in Polish still at the bottom. The two words in blue above my head. Oh, I gotta type my name in. Okay, and then let's see. Level one. Let's go with normal. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, I think that's good. All right, nice. Profile slash fishing net. Go fishing, settings, tournaments, equipment. Okay. Oh, this is going to be a little more... Oh, I see. These are presets. Okay, gotcha. Skills, economist, and dodger. Looks like there's daily, weekly, and monthly quests. Okay, statistics. Uh, let's see. Go fishing. I guess we could. We don't really have any money or anything to do anything else. Well, 200 bucks. Does that buy us anything? Oh. Well, kind of, but these are still spendy. Wow. Shiny. Alright, so we got rods, reels, lines, floats, leaders, feeder baskets, hooks... Baits, lures, sinkers, and accessories. What would be under accessories? Oh. Rod pods. Yeah. Alright, well, let's just go get started with what we got, and then we'll uh, figure it out. Uh, welcome welcome in, Ultimate Fishing Tutorial 2. Do you want to start tutorial? Sure. Teach me. Yeah, no dynamite, chat. I'm sorry. No dynamite. And you better not be watching me from over there in the bushes, either. Come out of there. Come fishing. Ooh, pretty. Movement. You can move around using WASD. On the right side of the screen, you'll find information about weather and equipment you're currently using. Look around uh, the fishing ground and then approach the water. Oh, press space. Uh-oh. Could be a honeycomb in this tree stump. There could be bears. wonder if there's, like, secrets around. Ready. Oh, there's a cabin. This is our running speed? Okay. It's awfully quiet. I've been noticing, by the way, more and more and more games now have like super loud menu music and then the game just gets like ultra quiet. It's like main menu is blaring and then uh, game is actually like you have to turn up the volume 700% just to hear like a horn honking in the distance or something it's crazy so games so many games are just like being quiet 
in the game. Or way too, way, way, way too loud. Uh, one of the more popular fishing methods is float fishing. Select the float by pressing 2. Oh, I can't go in there? No. Oh. Eh, let's go back to the dock. I thought maybe we could, like, find some cool hidden stuff or something. Bum, bum, bum. Cool. Can we fall in? No. Of course not. All right, let's see. Uh, the simplest way of casting the rod is the short distance cast. However, keep in mind to aim for a spot with sufficient depth. Prior to casting the rod, you can adjust the float depth with... Oh, the bracket keys? Um, perform a short distance cast by holding the PPM. The what now? I think they mean MMB? Some of this is like weird Polish translation that they forgot to translate, I think. Is this in English? Oh, we'll let Tan play. There. Okay, now we're playing in Italian. What the hell does controls mean? Oh, I can read Italian now. Sweet. Key bindings, display, audio. Oh my god, this game has made me smart. Uh-oh. Okay, now I'm dumb again. Better go back to... Impostion. What the hell kind of pasta is that? Oh god. Awful lot of language. Okay, we're good. Whew, okay. PPM is right mouse button? Weird. Uh, Evo, thank you very much for the 10, although it cut off the sound. I don't know why I did that, but thank you very much for the support. Very nice of you. Okay, so... The hell? Uh, that's right. Okay, the line is reeled in by pressing left mouse button. You can uh, change the reel speed with the mouse wheel. You can adjust the drag with plus and minus. You can reset the cast with Q. Now they want us to reel it in. Okay. Now let's reel it in, chat. All right, we're, get, we're getting a little out of control. Let's reel it in here. Yeah, that's pretty re re realistic. All right, you can perform the long distance cast by pressing and holding the left mouse button. The long distance cast. Let's go for. Ah, sweet. Where'd it go? I didn't even hear it. Or plunk. Usually you can hear it. Uh, next task is to catch a fish. You can use the underwater camera by pressing U to see what's happening underwater. Wait for the fish to become attracted to the bait. You? What a weird key to hit. Come on, fish. Be attracted. Yeah. When a fish takes the bait, you must hook it at the right moment. Try to make the line as tight as you can. Press the right mouse button to jerk. Did I do it? Wait. Right mouse button does nothing. Oh, here it does. Oh, you're supposed to hold it for a while. Maybe I need to reel in a bit. There we go. Okay, I was supposed to reel in a little bit. Alright. Try that again. The concept is solid, but their uh, translation is... Uh, you for underwater? Yeah, maybe, but why not just put it down like the, uh, I don't know, the Z key or something? Let's try that again. What's up, Tucker? Yeah, this is a tow rope. Uh-oh. Now the water's like super loud. In order to go back to the menu, you have to go back to f 
like first person mode, then you can press U. Otherwise, you can't do it from there. I can't believe that. What's up, Funkhauser? How you doing? Come on, brother. I can hear a fish. There it is. There we go. Once you hook the fish, you can freely pull it to shore. You come with me, sir. Ooh, rod physics. Massive. After catching a fish, you can either keep it or release it, uh, with each granting different bonuses. Release the fish now and select spinning set by pressing 1. I made 88 cents off of that fish. Who'd, who would give me 88 cents? Is this a fish fillet at McDonald's? They told me to release. Spinning fishing. It's time to uh, for a new type of fishing. In this step, you'll learn how to use the spinning method. Now perform a long distance cast by pressing the left mouse button. We're casting spells. Is this a Harry Potter game? Ooh. Do I like fishing in real life? I do, yes. Guiding the spinning lure. Guide the lure so that the effectiveness is as high as possible. In the upper right corner of the screen, lure indicator... When it turns green, it means the effectiveness is increasing. Uh, inc uh, reduce the retrieval speed to 10% and retrieve the lure until you get a bite. Keep casting until you manage to catch a fish. That's pretty easy. Wait, I need the underwater camera. There we go. Over here, dude. There we go. Wiggly worms. <laughs> Got him. Oh, this is fun. Uh, putting a fish in the net. It's like keep uh, to put a fish in your net. The net is used to manage fish. You can open it by going to the main menu and opening player profile. What's the difference between keeping or releasing in this game? European perch, a dollar thirteen. Ooh, it's an import, so it's a dollar more. Ooh, fancy. Uh, press M will open the map. Teleport to a particular spot by clicking the fishing ground. Fishing ground number. Change the weather. A teleporter. Where are we going? Oh, okay. Well, that would have been easier than walking over to the cabin. Oh God. <laughs> the line was flying all around. Uh, you can find all information you need in the help tab. Okay. All right, that's cool. So there's a few spots saved in the map, and then we can just teleport. Otherwise, we can just walk, go wherever we want. Listen to this music. Have you or a loved one been affected by Farthest Frontier? Please talk to your doctor about Farthest Frontier. Symptoms may include not playing other games, bush emotes, blueberries. All right, uh, let's see. Did we get any skills? No. Quests? Ooh. Catch this many of a given species. Five. Okay. Oh, and you can change. Nice. Uh, let's see. 
Chat, the new uh, the new bush emote is amazing too, by the way. I've asked Art to put blueberries on it, but he's busy with another creator right now doing a big project, he told me. Eh, soon. Soon. Do I actually want to go to the shop? Wait, we still only have 200 bucks? What? I got scammed from the tutorial. I should have like, what was it? $2? 88 cents plus a buck 13? Come on, bro. Oh, I just want... I could have at least got Tree Fitty. They should have gave me Tree Fitty. Jackson National Park. Ooh, these are pretty. Uh, oh, we gotta get to levels. Zalasi and Len... What? Letnisco? Slovakia? Ooh, the Kiel Canal. Uh, volcanic Lake in Russia. Ooh, pretty. Ooh, Thailand. Ooh, oh, that must be where we get the... Uh, there's a tiger shark you can catch in this game, and that's probably there. I always wanted to go to Thailand. I heard they had Taiwanese food in Thailand. I think I have to go. But I think for starting purposes, we're going to Jackson County, brother. Uh, we can change the time. Morning, noon, evening. Let's do a morning fishing run on a cloudy day. Let's see how that looks. Uh, Jackson is a city located in Wyoming. Flat Creek flows through it, which is a tributary uh, of the Snake... Oh, it's part of the Snake River. One of the most important rivers in the Yellowstone National Park. It is a major tourist attraction in part because it's located a few miles from the border of Grand Ten Ten Teton National Park? Some of these I've never heard of. Um, brown bullhead, sockeye salmon, rainbow trout, smallmouth bass, yellow perch, uh, grass. Some of these I've never even heard of. Pe pecorel, redfin, bluegill, largemouth bass, and pumpkin seed. Mmm, pumpkin. Sounds delicious. All right, let's go. Yeah, we're playing as the fisherman now in Farthest Frontier. Before we were playing as the hunter, now we're now we're the. We have a low food supply, so we got to go fishing. Oh, this is pretty. What the hell? Well, let's go walk around. <gasps> Can we go up in the treehouse, dude? The Swiss Family Robinson. Bruh. You remember playing a fishing game on PC when you were 9 or 10? Yeah. Yeah, a lot of them... There were a lot of games for a while in the fishing series that were all like bass pro shops, like super like bass fishing competitions where it was all like aggressive. It was try they were trying to be NASCAR, but on the water. And, you know, they were trying to just like put in like action music, like heart pounding action. And it would show like a giant... like. Someone would hook a fish and start to try to reel it in, and then, like, the boat would tip, you know, like, the like there'd be, like, a 45-degree tippage, like they were fighting the cr a kraken or something like that. Meanwhile, it's, like, a five-pound bass. <laughs> it's, like, it's like, okay, that's pretty that's pretty good bass, but also, dude, it's not going to, like, tip the boat over. And I was like, get the revolver! You know, but we got to put it down, cut the line, it's taking the boat under. Like, it's not that exciting. It's nice that this game is at least more casual, a little more relaxing. I'm wondering what's going to happen in uh, the way of the uh, the angler uh, Call of the Wild. Because I wonder what kind of fishing they'll allow us to do. You need to be able to like go in a canoe or a motorboat. I think this game is all dock fishing, though. But I'm just kind of curious to see what all types of fish we can get into. Let's take a look at the map. Oh, there's quite... Oh, this is very large. Old Bridge. Lumber Mill. And then the Snake River's down there. So we started, like, over here. Like, four or five. Oh, let's keep walking around. Let's go take a look. Anyone hear banjos? Wow. Yes, this is a bear-free environment. They were banned. Ooh, pretty. The Highway Bridge. Oh, I'm fishing in your state? Oh, good. I guess we don't have to, like, um... I guess technically unlocking the other locations is kind of like buying a license. But it's unlocked via, like, XP, I think. 
Is there like an encyclopedia for the fish? Or like... Well, I guess the main thing you want to do is probably... Uh, find where the quests are. Oh, that's weird. What the best thing to do is probably to find out what the quests are and then go find those fish and they'll give the most uh, XP. Oh, beautiful water wheel. This is definitely not farthest frontier. But yeah, I would say the best way to probably make XP and money is to find out what the quests are and then actually do them. But what, can you not see the quest till you go back to the main menu? Oh, I, I have to sell the fish. Okay. Add to aquarium. Oh, I get an aquarium? Ah, cool. Oh, we can get tournaments. Okay. So we can eventually enter tournaments, so that'll give us big money. Alright, well, let's go do a couple practice fish and get some money in, and then we'll figure out how to, like, uh, do a little bit more for probably the, um, see if we can do some questing. Let's go fish here. This looks nice. It'd be cool if there were cars that drove over. Wait a minute. Didn't I say morning? It says it's 1628. It's showing my local time. Wait a minute. It says type enter to chat. Oh, this is multiplayer. Oh. Wait, how would I invite somebody to my game? Maybe it's multiplayer like everybody plays single player, but the chat is multiplayer so you can see everybody else's scores. Maybe that's what it is. How much for the game on console? Um, I don't know if it's actually on console, is it? Yeah, bragging rights, right, yeah. Oh, here we go, here we go. Come on, baby. Right over here, pal. Is that a catfish? Oh, damn! Oh! Woo! Got a big one, boys. Oh, damn, he broke the line. That was a big one, dude. Holy crap. All right, what happens? Luckily, we probably don't have to re-spool it and do all that. Hi, duck. Okay, then. Wait, now, how do I... Oh, we have a flashlight. How do I fix the uh, the damage, though? Oh, I have to go buy a new lure and stuff? Oh, wow. Wait, so breaking a line means you actually have to buy... Okay, so I have to switch because it's too... Uh, that's cool. That's actually interesting. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh, how, how strong is this dude's cast? Yeah, I could have set the drag, but it's, it's it was my first try, so I'll learn as I go. It's a little different mouse and keyboard versus actually having a rod in your hand, but it'd be interesting if they actually made like a like a rod that you could play with. That'd be kind of cool. The uh, They used to have... Do you guys ever remember those like handheld fishing games where you could like see it all on like a... It was like a little LCD screen like a Game Boy, but then there was a little reel with it. It was sweet. Oh, another European. You come with me, pal. Yeah, you remember those games? Yeah, they were pretty cool. All right, well, we'll have to go with the slow and low ones. Oh, 
there we go. We're mostly here for the XP, so we can unlock new areas, but we're probably not going to get much with $2 purchase. All right, let's see if we can buy a new... Uh, Earthworms, okay. Oh, wow, you can actually pick. So you pick the uh, rod and reel. The uh, line and the... S oh, the leader, yep. Yeah. And no sinker with this set, but... Oh, I got to get to pro level or something. Okay. Oh, wow. They got a lot of stuff. Ooh. Now yeah, we had something like this before, I think. Oh, it's free. Wait, what? Oh, cool. They have free ones. Okay, so let's reset that. Okay, that's how we use that. Oh, what? A log can come by? Oh. So there's actually obstacles you need to worry about. That's going to be tricky for... Reeling things in sometimes. Okay, there's actual hazards to worry about. That's cool. I had said this thing was incomplete. What am I missing? A leader? No, that was on there. Oh, this guy's way too strong. It's in the water now. There we go. Oh my god. Jaws. Come on, pal. You're coming out whether you like it or not. Don't make me get my shotgun. Get out of here, duck. Mine. First try, yeah. Totally first try, chat. <laughs> hey, Michael. Thank you very much, dude, for becoming a member. All right, we got a sockeye salmon. Not bad, dude. New member. Welcome. Let's release. A new personal record. Uh, 0.75 kilograms, 37 centimeters long. We get five bucks for it. Uh, seven XP. So if we keep them, I think we can sell them, and then we can get money for it. Or we can release for XP. I think I want the XP so I can unlock, like, abilities and stuff. That's kind of cool. Alright, we're learning as we're going. I think we're getting better. This is fun. Michael, thanks for upgrading to a little raptor, dude. Appreciate your support. Let's get another one. This guy is way too strong with the, uh, with the, with the cast, man.
But I guess there'll be larger lakes and rivers to go to, so we'll see how it goes. Oh, 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 that's a big one. <gasps> Bro, is that a pike? Oh, nice. Oh. Another big boy. Oh, damn. <laughs> Jeez. Dude, we got to get a tow rope winch from the truck. That is crazy. Whew. I, I think that was a, po a beluga. Beluga whale. Hey, but no harm because the uh, bait is basically free. We better buy a couple of those. Oh, what's this? Doe? Doe way. Oh, we can get all sorts of, uh, $70 for a leech? What? Who the hell's gonna pay $70 for a leech? Unless you get it, like, forever. Is it, like, a one-time unlock and then you get it forever? That might make sense. Like, if it's a one-time fee and then you can equip it any time, that, that might be a better price. Yeah, maybe a pack, maybe? Oh, where were we? Lures. That was, uh... Ooh. Can I only buy one? Okay, we'll buy the free ones. Okay, um... Alright, that's cool. Let's do some bobber fishing now, though. A little bobber. Going up to Mille Lacs for the weekend. Gonna, gonna do a little bobber fishing there in, in my tracker boat. Hell? No? Okay, this spot's too narrow. Let's go somewhere else. Actually, wait, what happens if we try to teleport? Will it pack things up? Oh, yeah, cool. Ooh, all right, this is a little better. That's better. Let's try to go for another big one. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, damn, look at that one. Absolute shark over there. Oh boy. Is that a duck? Uh oh. Here comes a branch again. Is that gonna get t tangled up in the wire? Don't tangle my line. Oh, great. Oh, nothing happens. Oh, that's weird. I wanted to see what would happen, and I guess it's just a visual thing? Okay. Yeah, let's set depth here.
We're gonna reel it in and go for a little lower now. Oh, might act differently on the realistic setting. That could be true. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to try the... Uh, so how do I set the uh, leader length? That Plus and minus was for drag, but that doesn't seem to work. Oh, it's this key. Okay. Speed is mouse wheel. Key bindings was... Wait, what's this eagle eye mode? B. Change the view of the caught fish. Oh yeah, bracket keys, yep. Let's double the length and then let's do... Um... Flashlight's on just so we can see better, and then... What was that control? Oh, blur. Yeah, okay. Alright, things are set nicely. The game definitely looks beautiful. Let's turn shadows on. Yeah, that looks nice. Alright, let's do... Key bindings. Eagle eye mode was V, and then... Gu okay, GUI was G. Okay, so you can hide everything. Hello, duck. No? Here, look, a worm. Not interested. Alright, eagle eye mode. Not sure what that does. I'm fishing for compliments, chat. Just as an FYI. So, you know. Oh boy. Looking good today, my man? That's right. That's what I thought. Yeah, there we go. That's... Got one. Got a compliment, chat. Drag at 70 is pretty good for these European perch. Easy, yeah. Aw, cute. I want the XP. Gargantuan. Alright, let's see. Can I unlock skills here? Yeah, we gotta, like, exit. Right, let's try to get another big one. Largemouth bass, yeah. Well, we'll have to see if we can uh, go to some other lakes, too. They'll probably have many different fish types in different locations. I'm over here. Oh, dude. Yeah, we could probably try to do some uh, tournament fishing, yeah. Oh, we'll have to... We probably have to get to a certain level, and then we can unlock that. Here we go. 
Did he just swim through the rock? Torpedo. Seems like they're not too interested in the bobber here. Let's try the uh, t'other one again. Come on, boys. Oh, there's so many rocks in the way all the time. Then another uh, salmon. Oh, God. Uh, uh, oh, God oh, damn it. Hit the wrong button. I went for the other plus and minus when I let the drag out. What a drag. Try this one. Luckily, it's free. Wait, what? What? There we go. It tried to default to zero drag. We need some better uh, tackle, that's for sure. Everything's a little too uh, heavy for our uh, fishing line. You know, the keyboard setup's a little weird. Because, can I readjust that? Because they've kind of set up stuff where you got to like move your hand to three different parts of the keyboard. All right, let's try this. Now it's set the drag to 100. Weird. Maybe this would be a little easier on a controller. wonder if this is optimized for uh, consoles. Oh boy. 
the wrong button. Well, luckily, we have plenty of time to practice with the uh, cheap stuff. Fish soup? That sounds good. Got off our line. We didn't want that one. Is he just? I think we stun locked him. He's face down in the uh, dirt. Over here, sir. There we go. Okay, well, if our goal was to evade capture, I think we succeeded. <laughs> Try that again. They've got a really weird setup for things in the controls. But I like the game, but they've made things, like, really weird. How the controls are set up. Oh, he's swimming right for us. How nice. Okay, yeah, he was way too... Drag was 100%. And he was... That one was way too strong. All right, we need to buy some stuff that doesn't suck. Our equipment sucks. Um, finally, that time I did it right, but... Do they have anchor chain? I need anchor chain. Preferably battleship or carrier. Is there anything like that here? <laughs> yeah, I need, I need TNT. Steam says that it's got full controller cap capability. Okay. Uh, strength. So yeah, okay. The ones that we're pulling in are like 0.78. We need something not not crap. How much XP do we have? Level one. We can buy the level one stuff. Now let's try that out. A lot of things are kind of like locked behind XP. Yeah, we need we need to be level two to unlock a lot of the good stuff. So in order to make it more challenging, they've made it so you have to use. A little more challenging setup. Makes sense. Well, let's try that. That's interesting that they made it that way. I like that. They made it a little more challenging.
Let's go to... Okay, so let's go ahead and make sure we got that on there. Oh yeah, cool. We can buy more than one at a time. Okay, that's better. This is weighted for 1.30. So before we were like kind of eh. Now we have a particularly small chance rather than no chance. Ba -ba -ba. Yay! We went from low to no. Or from no to low. Yay. Well, that's much better. Yeah, there we go. Very good. Very good. Man. That line made a little bit of difference. And that is, wow, seven bucks for that one. Hell yeah, big step up. And 10 XP too. Hell yeah, brother. Give me that XP so we can get to level two. So right now, we don't want money. We want XP to unlock new stuff. Then we got to go to like tournaments and things like that. That'll bring in the money. And then once we win all the money, then we can say, Here comes the money. Here we go. Money talks. Here comes the money. Kiss him and throw him back. I did that with Pinto once. Haven't seen him in five years. Wait, what? My, my oh, well, my mic was on. Sorry. Do a catch and cook? Hell yeah, brother! A shore shore lunch, shore thing with a shore lunch. All right, now we got to do just a little bit better line. We got a little bit of a chance. Oh, he ain't coming over. There's no way. He's not interested. Oh, don't give me a crappy perch or anything. Man, that line is great. That was a big upgrade, just, buy <laughs> just buying a little bit of cheap line. I don't know why they just didn't give you a better one to start with. Like, you have to immediately change it anyway, like, pretty much after the tutorial, so... And they give you 200 bucks, but... I guess if you want to go fishing for molecules. But then again, I guess it's there just to teach you what it's like to buy stuff and how to use the menu. Come on, pal. Can't fight it. Small mouth bass. All right. Right, let's go for that XP. Ooh, and five bucks on that one. 17 XP. Very nice. Okay, uh, let's go to a new location. Let's go to the Big O River. Just down the down the street. <laughs> that line's flying all around. Let's go over here. I gotta say, though, it's beautiful. Like, if you just want to chill out, turn brain off... This is very good. Although I could see it also having some challenge and some competition too with the uh, tournament element. Oh, there's a little dock there. Let's go there. Actually, wait a minute. 
That's not position four. A beautiful game? I agree. It is very beautiful. Let's go over Meow. All right. Come on. I wonder if we have to take into account times and such for active time and whatnot, or if rain makes them more active. Well, that's good. Hey, okay, sir, you're coming with me. All right, if you know the fish, you got to call it. Some of these I don't know. I'm mostly a walleye guy. And uh, Northern Pike. This is a... Oh, it's a fish. Oh. A brown bullhead. Yeah. Get out of here. Call it Bruce. No. Sharks are bears of the sea. I wonder what gives you more money and XP in this game. Like, is it based on weight or rarity or... I mean, I'm sure you'll get some good bonuses in the tournament. Over here, sir. Mr. Bass. There we go. Uh, nothing like fishing. Yeah, that line made all the difference. Hold the line. And this is... <laughs> oh, there's bait caught onto our bait. A grass pickerel. At least for five. Oh my god, that's a shark. I can see the fin. That spot's kind of like got small fish. Let's go somewhere else. Spot's kind of not cool. Uh, let's go over to. Let's go to over to four. We'll just mosey on over. I like this spot though. The bridge was cool. Uh, it's kind of close to the dock, but let's go all the way over there. Alright, now I'm getting the hang of it and uh, feeling a little better. But the thing about these types of games, too, is that once you got the hang of it, they want to throw in some new mechanics. And thus, that's where the new maps will come in and the new... Uh, so thus new fish, so thus new uh, lures and rods and reels and tournaments. I can see this game being chill, but then like very satisfying to unlock things. Plus the skills too, which make it kind of RPG-like. Oh, damn! I think that was a beluga. Okay, well, that was definitely a big boy. That's a good spot. We're hitting that one up again. That was a big boy. See if we can get him again.
Yeah, maybe there's fly fishing. Yeah, I'm sure there's all sorts of types. Other than just, um... Oh, boy. There we go. We got him. Massive fish. Can't believe he didn't break off at a whopping 0.21 kg. Whew. Careful, boys. Stand back. It's a pumpkin seed. Oh, what was that? F3 for show. Oh, we've already... Oh, that's where we see our goals. Okay. Catch fish of any species weighing a total of 10 kg. or over halfway. Catch five... Sp Fish of any species catch this many of given species, 10. Oh, damn. All right, we've been kicking ass. That's not bad. Go for another one. Your wife's nickname is Pumpkin Seed? Oh. Oh, there we go. Woo! It was the same guy. <laughs> it's, the, it's the same crappy from 10 seconds ago. It's the same pumpkin seed, boys. It's Halloween out here. Doesn't matter. Increases that XP. 0.13. My goal is to try to get a fish that literally weighs nothing. Actually, negative. Negative weight. Like, I want it to be an anti-gravity fish. Oh. Wrong. Oh. Wrong button. Wrong button. You want me to catch a boot? I'm gonna catch a cold out here. Actually, it's 14. Ooh. Oh, bird. Ready. So, okay, so now what we need, boys, we need a game that combines fishing and hunting elements. We need a game where it's like this, and then when you're bored with this, then you go hunt like a white-tailed deer, or go shoot a bear, or duck hunting, or something. It needs to be a game that combines both. And then needs to combine it into a, uh, like a survival element, where you have to prepare for winter or something like that, by getting enough uh, fish and whatever else to survive. And this is a smallmouth bass of 1.05. How are we doing on the XP? Oh, we're 93 out of 100. Okay, if we get one more fish, we'll be level 2. Very nice. How's money well spent on that line? Go for one more. Yeah, we could have surf and turf then, yeah. Uh-huh over here far cry is like that really the far cry uh, five i think i liked uh five setting a little bit more than six but six was still pretty cool with uh jean carlo ex esposito that guy's cool man jean carlo's uh bamf what's up toby how you doing my man Welcome again to all you new members. Thanks for all the likes, too, boys. Uh, smash like if uh, if you've ever gone fishing or if you enjoy the uh, 
Yeah, just the outdoors in general, even if you don't go hunting and fishing often, if you like being out walking around lakes and stuff, I certainly do enjoy that, going out on a nice walk near a very nice Baco Lake. Oh boy, that is... That is Jaws, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna need a bigger reel. This one could weigh half. Pumpkin seed again. A <laughs> point one zero. All right, what do we need? Three more XP, I think. We're going way out there. Uh, hello? Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, no, 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 no. Meow. Okay, let's do... You just purchased the game? Awesome. Enjoy. We're going for one more fish, and then we make it to the next level. We just gotta really bring in anything, so it doesn't doesn't really matter what we get. Oh damn, look at that one. Ooh, that's a big one. Wow. I think that was a spruce fish. Possibly a pine. Looked like it was a Douglas fir fish. Wow. Majestic. A torpedo fish. That's the type of fish you don't want to catch. A pine gill, yeah. Popular amongst these parts. Oh, is that another bullhead? Sir? Don't you fight me. Oh, good, we tired his ass out. Oh, we should right click to kind of tire their ass out a little bit. A little different in the game than it is real life, but still we got our XP. Oh, what? You... Oh, you... Oh, it was three. Good. Wait, that should be level... What? 99? I knew I was off by one. The rare birch fish, yeah. Hey, this world's beautiful, though. This has just got me excited about, like, uh, the angler and stuff. Actually, the angler, interestingly enough, only comes out, like, in a few days. Like, it's like... I think it comes out on the 31st or something, and it's got me curious to see how the hell they're gonna make a, uh... Like, fishing is cool, but I don't think you need to make it open world, you know? Like, driving between the lakes and stuff is kinda, like, not necessary. So I wanna see how they gamify that and or make it relaxing. Cause it is beautiful, like, to drive around a... If they make a beautiful world to drive around, and it's like, hey, go dr drive over to this lake, now drive over to this river, now drive over to this pond. You got you got three many many different fish you can catch. <laughs> if you get a catch <laughs> catfish, you'll fry it up for chat for the, with the American sauce. Oh, some somebody's talented. Get over here, sir. I just need the one XP. Level two! Pog! We did it! Alright, cool. Wait, the XP kind of like kept ticking up. So it doesn't give you the XP right away? You gotta like wait a minute? Alright, whatever. Uh, so what does this mean? 20 bucks plus 5 boost. What? Five minute boost? Oh, we get more XP for five minutes. Wait, is this a mobile game? The hell? And a skill point. Alright, let's go back to the... Uh... 
How do I like give myself XP? And yeah, let's exit location and see if we can spend a skill point. And maybe we'll go to a new location. Oh, we gotta get level three. Lake Gilwa? Where the hell is this? Wait, is this Poland? This must be Poland or something. I don't know. Anyway, um, skill points, right? New skill point. Uh, let's see. Increases the sale price of fish by 5%. Oh, you can put them in the aquarium for a while. Oh, we have, we have to start at the top. Okay. Uh, let's see. Five more experience per fish you catch. Kind of like that one. Increase the effectiveness of five and accelerate the time it takes to get a bite. Oh. Oh. Fish in an aquarium grows 5%. We can catch a fish, put it in the aquarium, and then, like, release it later for more money? That might be a, a thing. So wait, where's my aquarium, though? Go to residence. Oh, damn, I got a house? Oh, damn! Wow. Looks like things are going real well on the YouTube channel. This must be the future. Oh, this is cool. This is more like we've got, like, a museum. You better not push me in. Yeah, that's my IRL house. Okay, so we I think we can actually like capture fish and grow them here in our museum and then like release them when they're a little larger. I wonder if we can like actually get um Wait, what was that? One. Oh, I see. Okay. I wonder if we actually can, like, charge admission and, like, the more fish that we catch, we can store here and people can come in and take a look at it and we get money. That'd be cool. That would actually be a really interesting game mechanic. Ah, this makes me miss going to uh, zoos and things like that. Kind of cool. I've, I've seen that before on the Great Lakes. There's, uh, in Duluth in Minnesota, there's a very big museum where they uh, have a lot of fish where they... They're, they're continuously putting them into the lakes to make sure that their populations are replenished. And before they release them, they like they put them in museums and you can see all the fish and all the different types and learn about the importance of conservation and stuff. And they each year release them back into the, you know, as they grow, they release them at different stages to make sure there's always a population. That's cool. Oh, wait, what else do I have? I had a house and then... The tanks look tropical, yeah. Well, there could... I mean, there are some for uh, Thailand, so we're top, talking about tropical fish, too. That's cool, dude. Uh, no, I don't want to exit the desktop. I would like to go to... Open fishing net. Okay. Let's release that fish. Just a tiny boy. I didn't see our fish in the aquarium. We could have probably added them. Oh, we can... Okay. Oh, this is interesting, too. So we actually have a fishing net with us. So this is how many we can hold. 15 kg of fish. So then we can either sell them or put them in the residence, to which we have four aquariums. Oh, this is where we put our trophy fish. Cool. You can't have an evil lair without an eel. Are you calling me Ursula? Because I am way more beautiful than she is. Way more. And I'm more business savvy. She did have Ariel sign that contract, though. Of all the Disney bosses, she's like the only one who used litigation. To which, honestly, Ariel was in the wrong. I think if if in that agreement, Ariel agreed to arbitration, she probably would have lost in a court of law against um, Ursula, to be honest. 
Seriously, think about it. Ursula had her sign a contract, Ariel agreed to it, and then killed her. So, you know. King Trident's all-powerful, but Disney lawyers? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. All right, let's go with the more skill points per catching. Or no, increase the speed in which it takes to get a bite. All right, let's go back fishing, and then we'll see if we can catch some more fish. That's bad. I like that mechanic where you can actually, like, hold on to the fish and let them grow and whatnot. Ariel got her boyfriend to kill her. Oh, really? Oh, she had an accomplice? Let's do an evening light rain. Let's go out fishing in the rain. Game's chill, dude. I, I like the mechanics of that. That's pretty neat. I wonder if this will bring out different fish types or something. Let's all close our eyes for a second and just take in this beautiful sound. New definition to thunderclap. Let's go fishing. All right. Uh, let's see. Wait. Oh yeah, we're good. There was an interesting spot over here I wanted to fish on. Is this like a bridge? Oh, there's the bridge. Okay. Well, let's fish this way. Oh. It, this guy's cast is like Superman, dude. Just a flick of the wrist and it's gone to the next state. Come on, fishy. We're trying to be efficient. Bright lures are best in the rain, yellow and white. Oh, interesting. Oh, God. Well, some somebody likes us. Sir? Gonna have to ask you to pull it over. That's a pickerel again, isn't it? The grass grass pickerel? Yep. Woo, big boy, point three zero. Keep getting that XP. Uh where were the big I like going back over here. Actually let's go to area four. And standing over here we got pretty lucky last time. Yeah. This was a nice spot. Lucky, I can feel it. I wonder if this game actually does take into account things like uh, lure color and... I mean, I'm sure a lot of things are simplified for... You know, to make it a fun, fun, satisfying game, but we'll see how, how realistic it is. On the other hand, you got to make it fun for kids and casuals and YouTubers. But challenging and satisfying, like filling out your taxes. No, that's a lie. Well, the second part. All right, Tan, fire up the uh, the frying pan. Who's doing some cooking? Ooh, that's a good one. 0.84 at 12 XP, not bad. And now that we got that first perk, we can just start reeling them in left and right. Standing by. Standing by. Standing by. Standing by. No, you wrote standing. Don't correct now. It's too late.
What goes good with a good shore lunch, chat? What do you guys like? Some taters? I miss having a beer battered fish. Oh, yes, roasted potatoes. Oh, lemons. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. Beer battered fries, nice. Ooh, pumpkin seeds, almost Halloween. Coleslaw? That doesn't sound that bad. I'd try that. Oh yeah, corn on the cob for sure. All right, after this I'm gonna try to uh, change the, uh, the bait color and see if we get anything different. It's a pretty good productive spot though. We're making a lot of a lot of good progress here. XP wise. Eventually we're gonna have to not worry about XP and start getting uh gonna have to start getting um money. Cause that's how we're gonna buy all of our Well we gotta pay off the museum somehow. <laughs> that ain't free. But if you've ever eaten uh, a fish that you've caught yourself before, you know nothing tastes better than food that you make and uh, you know at home, and then also fish that you've caught, or you know, deer or whatnot. <laughs> Bin the fish and go to Wendy's for their all-new Atlantic cod. Oh yeah, the smell of a campfire and. Little fried fish like that? Oh my god. Oh, uh, gotta change the lure next time. Go for the bottom feeders. Oh, never mind. Oh, grass pickerel again, right? Good. Yep. Actually, what what level is level two now? One twenty six away to level three. I mean, this is satisfying, dude. Teriyaki salmon with parmesan crusted asparagus and roasted mini potatoes. Sometimes chat is just too good. Oftentimes, Chad is like, didn't have a lot of time tonight, made a four-course meal, dessert, and I also uh, re I like reorganized the living room to be 4% more efficient. Also, I've uh, solved uh, light travel. Like, I have de developed a device that can transport man through time and space. It's like, okay, didn't have a lot of time. Something simple. Yeah, okay. I like how they set pack. It's kind of cool. I like how they sell packages where it's like already pre ready to go stuff that they would recommend to just do stuff right off the start. You know, like rather than having to go and painstakingly buy every line and every float, every leader, every bait, it's just boom, ready to go. Kind of nice little start. Starter package is kind of nice, convenient. All right, so we got to get to 126, and then we're probably going to start getting money. And I'm number one. Out of 226 people, I'm number one. I don't know what that means, but I'm going with it. Damn, this rain is satisfying as hell. Damn it, I couldn't hit the button fast enough. That was a that was a good one. Yeah, I'm at.
Bum, bum, bum. It's a little harder to lower the drag rather than raise. There we go. Finally did it. Whoa, what the hell? Did he just jump out of the water? Sweet. I did it, chat! I finally learned how to <laughs> lower the drag. Sir? Sir, relax. Oh boy. You are 34 meters out there, sir. Tire his ass out. There we go. He's he's getting away, there's no way. Sir? Oh my god. Relax. He wow, he's he's going to the other ends of the earth. Woo. Real 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 go 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 speed 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 go go speed speed speed. We're getting them boys. Come on, feller. Brother, that is a hog wild one right there. Come on. Yep, yep, yep. That's it. That's the sweet spot. Come on now. Got him down to 30. 29. We're almost there. Come on, baby. 27. He's coming. He's coming. Come on, baby. There we go. All right, tire him out. Come on. Twenty six. He's at twenty six. Where is he going? You got a date tonight? What's he doing? God. We're going to need a better, uh, I should have bought some better string. coming over now he's coming over come on baby come on over here come on oh my god this that this is fun as hell this is great this is really fun oh he's tired out now we got him we got him we got him we got him we, we, we got him <laughs> Woo! that was awesome what a fight get over here sir wow what a battle 
Holy crap. Oh yeah, 26. I'm going to release you, sir, for that juicy 26 XP. Wow. <laughs> A bird comes by and snags it. Oh, that was great. That was great. All right, let's see if we can buy some better line. That was awesome, dude. He was... Man, I thought that was over. We got to get the anchor chain on here. That was a beauty, damn. That was beautiful. So do we want... We want mono braided? Do they have braided? They do. Braided for 1.80. Two point two zero. Holy crap! Well, we, okay, we can't get the. Uh, we can buy a braided. Hmm. Braid doesn't have the stretch like nylon. That'll matter. Oh, really? Where there where there's salmon, there's bears. Oh, I see. Chat's just been paying a bear the whole time to hide in a bush to just keep an eye until the salmon pop up. Well, let's try a mono for a little while. Let's do, uh, we'll do the 220 and see how that goes. And let's throw that onto this one. Oh, wait, do we have different? Ooh. Level four. Oh, you do actually get... You have to... Oh, that's cool. The more it breaks, you actually have a limited length of it. So this is 148 meters. And this one's another... Well, that one's untouched, but that's cool. So you can actually run out of length and have to buy a new uh, spool. That's actually really cool. So it's not like permanently unlocked or whatever. You have to buy more. I like that. That's cool. You got to be a little more careful. How it be in real life. All right. Let's see if we can get the River King again. Capture a nuclear sub this time. Oop, wrong button. Well, that's free XP. Oh, sorry. Didn't see you there. Oh, 5 XP. All right. Not going to say no to that. Is there a way to set drag? Yeah, it's uh, plus and minus keys. You can set a few more settings on, like, the uh, loader. The bobber, but... Going out there uh, on a Wednesday with Pat. I'm gonna go see if we can get some crappies and some walleye. Uh, oh, he was going for it. That was a small one, though. Good riddance, sir. A grassy boy? Okay. Oh, did he let go? I didn't really... 
Didn't really need him. Do and get another king. Freebie. Sounds like three XP free. Ooh, six. Double. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go up river. What is the car here? Can you actually like go back to your car and like go to the HQ or something, or what is this? There's like a car, but I don't... There mu it must be a way to like immersively walk back. What? Every one of the streams? No. Just the one particular one he asked for. Oh, here's the parking lot. Thank you, Tan. What's the point of the parking lot, though? I, I, don't, I don't get why they put a parking lot in. Like, it's cool that they put it in, but they marked it on the map, but, like, what am I going to do? It's been every single day. Yeah, no, he asked for one the w one stream, and I was like, yeah, sure, dude. Like, once is okay, but... <clears throat> like, Booster and Thurston, uh... Well, every, everybody's welcome to post if they're doing, like, a... Like a one... Like, the start of a series. Like, if Booster's starting Farthest Frontier, he can put his first stream on there. I don't know, it's, it's gotta be enough to keep you guys, like, interested, but not be annoying, you know? It's like me. That's why I only stream for four hours. Oh, there's a there's a new member. All right, yeah, that juicy content was too alluring. There we go. See? Rainbow Trout, thanks for clicking the tap and join, dude. Appreciate the eight XP. There you go. That's how it's done. At least there's no bears out here. Catch any monsters? Uh, well, actually, I don't even... Is there a way to check and see what our biggest fish was? There might be. I think our biggest one was uh, the one that put up the most fight, although... Big fish doesn't always mean, like, good... Like, fun fight. Tucker, you're a 50 XP trout? Yeah. Well, everyone knows I'm quite the catch anyway. You just gotta lure me with something shiny. Oh, that looked like a bull head. And it's putting up a fight like one, two. Bull heads are like... They hit really hard, and then they're like, Oh, I gotta fight for my food? Oh, boring. I'll just die now. Yep, exactly. I knew it, sir. You with your mustache. Get out of here. Why does Cryptic Fox have a gray box and a check mark? Probably because he has over 100,000 subscribers. That's like the verification system of YouTube. Like a verified official account. 
But that's not always uh, like the case. Sometimes you can have less than that if you're like an official brand account or something. Yeah, or food, yeah. Food will do it. Dude, this game is so chill, I could actually imagine myself, like, staying in the game and stopping and opening up, like, a cooler and have a lunch while I'm sitting here on the dock, as if I were actually here. I feel like I want to do that sometimes with, like, ATS and stuff, like, pull over and have an actual lunch. Sonic Adre Adventures for Dreamcast, you must fish too. You know, Dreamcast had some really badass fishing games. Like, seriously, I thought of all the, uh... Like, Dreamcast had the best fishing games, PS2, eh, and then there wasn't really any that, like, were interesting at all. Except for, like, until I saw The Angler, and, and then this game many years ago, uh, Ultimate Fishing from before. But I think there should be more multiplayer games, like fishing, where you can just stand with friends. I think the other game was like this too, where you could see like the outline or a shadow of your friend and then you could stand next to everybody on the dock. And then just like, just fish next to each other and like, you couldn't really mess with each other, it was just like a competition. Alright, well, there you go. Let me check something here. That'll do. Sega Bass Fishing with the Rod and Reel Controller. Yeah, that was good too, man. Fish Fry Simulator. Wait, that, was that a real game? Oh, Marine, yeah. You know, actually, I don't mind the other games, too, like Fishing Barren Sea and stuff, where you're setting up, like, you know, you're either crab fishing or, like, you're doing, uh, you know, nets and things like that. That's pretty cool. Fishing Planet is a really good fishing game. You can fish with friends or strangers. Okay. I, I gotta look at all the fishing games I have, because I, I know that the last couple that I played have been really fun. You know, like, if, if I was playing with, like, Bradford, Alex, and everybody else, if we were just hanging out playing this, this would just be a lot of fun. Just wasting time and just, you know, just putzing. Not doing anything, you know. Could be out robbing banks, but, you know. That would be a yellow perch. Chat, you're right. All right, let's go to the other side. Do I do any fishing? Not currently. It's been a few years, but I, I certainly have before. I've gone hunting and fishing. I've gutted fish and deer and uh, grouse and pheasant and... Um, I haven't gone duck hunting, though. Never done that. I would like to... Actually, I have, but I just haven't... Never, never got anything duck hunting. It's kind of a short notice attempt. What is this? This is, this is a really weird... It's like we're on a pallet. Oh. Uh-oh. What? Your line can actually get stuck? Oh, interesting. You can actually get caught on stuff and you break the line by being an idiot? That'd be kind of funny. Fishing Planet is free, but it's kind of a grindy game. Oh, yeah, I suppose. If it's going to be free, it's got to be grindy and whatnot. Yeah, those are the rules. Hey, yeah, there's uh, there's bobber fishing, yep. There's definitely bobber fishing. Oh, it's another uh, damn bullhead. Come on, man. These guys are boring. Free XP, though, so, I mean, it's, you know, shouldn't complain. They just put up as much fight as me after eating a Baconator. All right, let's see. Um, yeah, none, right. All right, let's get to level three. Our goal now is to get to level three, and then we get to go to a new map. So let's let's grind this out for like another two minutes or so, and then let's go to a different map. How is it so far? I like this. Um, 
I wasn't sure exactly how it would be. A couple things were weird in the tutorial and at the start, but now that I got the hang of it and got a couple fish, my excitement and my... I'm hooked. Hold on, I gotta give myself one of these. Uh-oh. No, I broke it. Come on, Chad. That was good. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Heavy hitter right there. Oh, you're not doing anything against this anchor chain, are you, sir? Eh, you can't really fight that one. Uh-uh. Yeah, you're coming right over here, pal. Yeah. A mammoth. 1.22 kilograms. Wow. A 17 XP behemoth. How oh, sweet. fishy. Boom! Well, another uh, grassy boy, but that's fine. One, X, two, XP. Kind of weird how it like slowly ticks up like that. Like, why not just give the full XP? It's weird. It like, it kind of like decides. It's like the wheel on uh, Wheel of Fortune. Or uh, Price is Right. Like, just give me the, just give me the damn points. It's calculating. Yeah, but is it, what is it, GPS? I guess it's more exciting when you when you get towards the uh, later fish and it's actually li like you're catching 50 pound sharks or 400 pound sharks that's when it's going to get exciting oh my god was that a whale? Oh, damn, that was a strike. Yeah, brother. All right, now we get to go to Poland. Hell yeah. Well, let's get out of here. Let's go to a new spot. Brother, yeah! Nice. Oh, we gotta buy a license for 50 bucks. Yeah, we got the money. Let's do noon on a... Clear sky day. Brother, yeah. Poland unlocked. Polska. That's me. Ooh. Oh, wait, we're at a hobbit village or something. Wait, let's take a look at the map.
go into the old cabin. Brother, brother, yeah. <laughs> Kingdom come deliverance, really? Yeah, we're in uh, medieval dynasty right now. Take a little tour. Oh, I thought those were cabins over here. But this is a good spot to go fishing. The teleportation points aren't just necessarily like where we should fish either. It's like recommendations, I think. Let's go over to that dock. Pretty. Uh... I think it's over here. Is that a bridge? It's a weird dock. It's sitting way high up. Ah, right, here we go. This is good enough. Oh, we can see the dock from here. And we can see the dock from here. Let's see what we got waiting for us here. Bloop. Fish the duck. Good spot right here. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it, sir. A northern pike. There we go. Nice. Ooh, 17 XP. Almost 50 uh, centimeters long. Nice. Can you fish without seeing underwater? Yeah, you have the option. Like, you can turn it on and off. I guess I just do it for the excitement. It's kind of nice to be able to see it. But yeah, if you if you don't want to look, you can, like, you can go out of the view and do it all from here. Kind of a little more, you know, fair and realistic this way, but... You know, it's your game, so, like, if you play and you're like, Nah, I don't want to, I don't want to see the underwater camera, then you can just not, not do it. A little more exciting this way, though. Over here, sir. It's coming. Okay.
So this or Call of the Angler? Uh, you know, good question. So that game's not out yet. That one comes out on the closer to the 31st, so I'm not exactly sure. You know, I haven't played it yet, so... But that one seems to be more open-worldy with driving around and doing other stuff, so... I guess we'll see. I mean, this is fun, though. But I think with each game, you get kind of a different experience. Like, that one might even be more realistic and more immersive and more open-world. But it could also cost more. So, I mean, you know, if you just want more of a chill experience and whatnot and just want to go to different locations, it's like, I think both will be good, but it just depends on how far you want to get into it. Might need spoons for this place. No, I'd probably eat, probably eat a fish with a fork and a knife. I think that'd be easier. Yeah. Oh, right, it's, yeah, it's Jerry's stream or whatever. Oh, we can try to buy a spoon. Let's try a new, uh, let's try a new lure then. That says daredevil. Uh, we got to be a certain level to get those, though. Yeah, we can get o only level three stuff. We can do the silver red. We also have spinners too. We can get the first two. Hmm. A lot of these we just can't get at the moment. Hmm. Let's try a... Uh... Oh, $54? Oh, if we buy something, it better be the right choice. I bought it twice on accident. Didn't make a noise. That's right. We'll have a backup just in case. Which is likely. I do like the fact that you can lose lures and have to use um, additional uh, line and stuff like that if it breaks. It's kind of cool. And I wonder if, like, for example, if you set up multiple rods with the same line, if it would take away from how much you have so you can only set up so many you know, rods with the same bait, or, I mean, same setup.
Frogs would be good here? Okay. Most species have color vision and some can even see in ultraviolet. Oh, really? Interesting. That was a massive splash. Have I played the latest uh, St. Rose game? No. I have not played that one yet. interested oh oh he was interested for a second Try the soft bait again. Try to get something at least. Need to generate some XP. Oh, they actually jump out of the water. That means they'll probably take top bait then. Sir, lunch right over here. Hey, wow. There we go. Finally. Well, nice. An asp. Okay. Tiny boy. All right, chat, you think we should use a lighter line? Okay, let's try that. Let's 
Let's try that. Or you think the leader needs to be lighter? I will right, we'll reel it back in slow and make a change. Am I enjoying it? I am, yep. I am. I'm liking this. Oh, you're right. The icon on the right needs to be green. You're right. Let's change to two point five. Yeah, live bait. We can get worms. It's kind of weird how we can like we have to pay for them. Like, could, don't couldn't we literally just like dig them up, feed from the lake? It's kind of cool mastering some of the uh, lures, too, because all of them are a little different. Some of these I've not seen or used either in years and forgotten how they work and or have never seen before. There's techniques I've never used because I've just never gone for those fish before. Ah, there we go. Seems like we, we have to pull it too fast, though. I don't think the fish will be able to catch up with this. Do we have to be in the top part of the water for this? Okay. I wonder how somebody would figure this out if they didn't have like a chat or whatnot around. Let's try the uh, setup number two. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to make some adjustments for this. You fell off a dock once trying to grab fish. Oh, I, yeah, I'm sure we've all done that before. Okay, so we set it with bracket keys. So let's do like two and a half meters, maybe. Well, that's as far as we can go. Good. 
At least with this setup. Oh, into the slimy stuff? Great. Yeah, that's good. That's a good setup. Yeah, there just needs to be a fish around. Let's go for maybe 175. Looks like we we're a little too low. Good spot, but. We can also try a different bait, too. Any different lures, baits. Yeah, we tried a spinner bait before. That worked out good. But we want we want to try to get some of the bigger boys over. Hmm. How many rods can you have out at a time? Looks like there's like six presets where you can have you can have like six loadouts saved before you have to edit them, which is pretty nice. He said 44. Oh, come on. I gave him I gave him the drag. Oh well. That turd. Uh oh wait, did we get our line back for free? 
He must have just came loose. They still see the bobber there. Uh, what kind of fish was that, boys? That looked like a new one. I'm going to go back to the other world and try to grind some more XP. I want to get some more lures and money. Seems like we're going to need some more XP for that. Let's get to 159. Go to the other, back to the other one. Oh, it was an, a water fish. Nice. That was a carp? Yeah, it looked, it looked different than the European uh, perch. Yeah. That was a good fight, though. He was smarter than the average bear. I mean, uh, uh oh. Let's try this one. Sir? Okay, you're not you're not that strong, sir. Let's I guess my line's a little weaker too, isn't it? Jeez. Come on, feller. He's almost there.
Hey! He baited me. Woo! All that for that? Oh my god. <laughs> oh man. 23 XP though. That was good. That was a good fight. I think we can bring him in much faster though with the uh, like in terms of just grinding XP. What's worth the prize is always worth the fight. You mean traffic to go to Wendy's drive through Then again, you know what I think we uh, could buy too that I bought new, uh, you know, the new lure and the new line and all that stuff, but what we didn't think about buying is like a new reel. If I buy a new reel, it'll probably let that other lure be a little bit more effective. The spoon? I didn't think about buying like a... I didn't think about buying a new um, reel for it, so that way I could keep it at a green speed. I'll have to take a look at pricing on those. No, you don't, sir. You're coming right over here. All right, let's see. All right. Ooh, a price a thousand. Uh oh. Can I sell stuff I don't want? Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Ooh, wow. Oh, look at... Look at how expensive those are. 600 for the... Oh, man. Spinning reel. Oh, there's no spinning reels in the game? Oh. Huh. Weird. We could also get a new rod, too, but that's going to be about 350. So we got to grind some money now, boys. All right, so let's go for... Um, goal one is going to try to get to the next level of XP. So let's try to go to level, level four, and then we'll just tr try to start uh, grinding cash. Need to get some money. Nice. Money, money, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, we can get in the tournament, true. In order to get in the tournament, though, I guess we'll... So we got to grind for equipment, grind a little bit of money, grind a little, X, little XP for a lot of money and a lot of XP. That's kind of a good point. Let's check that out. Let's 
small moth bass. Well, that was worth it. We might need to exit for that. Let's let's go back and change like daylight or something. Tournaments. Let's see. Oh, total wait. Wait, is this remaining time? Eight minutes forty-five seconds. You get a hundred bucks or uh, three hundred bucks. Entry fee fifty. Oh. Okay, so you actually got to have like a little. Wow, oh, twenty-two hundred bucks. You have a. Oh, that's is cool. That's actually really cool. You got eleven hours to get as many fish as you can. That's cool. Or you can create a tournament. Huh. That's actually really cool. Oh, we we had more skill points, don't we? Didn't I? Wait, I got to level three and I didn't get any skill points. Interesting. <clears throat> What's up, James Smith? Good to see you. Good to see you. All right. Let's go back and grind out some money. Money. Money, money, money. Money, 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 money. Yeah, yeah, money. Or XP. Which I guess every time we level up, we do get money for it. So at least it's like best of both worlds. These fish have been the most fun so far. But it seems the most fun to do it this way. Can you catch any bears in this game? Yeah, you can catch them uh, leaving the scene and leaving me alone. Oh god, that's a bear. The game updated for you a couple of minutes ago with a 17.4 megabyte update? Okay. Thank you for the tip, my man. Appreciate it, brother. Cool. Oh, only 3 XP. Do you get money when you release fish or only when you keep them? Well, you get money when you release them when you get, like, leveled up because you get XP for it. Yeah, get a bear perch. Uh-huh. 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 <sighs> Another one. XP here is too low. Mm. We need more money. More XP, more fish. Try to go here.
Yeah, changing the uh, lure type and such. That'll change the uh, fish we attract. Pumpkin seed. Five XP. Look like a perch. Oh, smallmouth bass. Well, it's nice to see a bass. Go up this way. Uh, when does the angler come out? Uh, yeah, the angler call of the wild, I think, is out on the 30th or 31st. We're going to take a look at that, too. I think we'll probably like that one a little bit more for, like, the story. And there's, like, probably driving and some thing, more things we can buy. I'm, I'm kind of wondering, like, what they'll do. Aside from, like, being able to buy your rod and reel and all this stuff associated with fishing, I wonder if they'll let you buy, like, a boat or maybe tow it around or something. It's not long until it's out, so I, I don't think there'll be any of that in it. Otherwise, they'll do, like, a... It'd be a complete surprise, but... Let's try a little of this fishing. That is incomplete. Oh. Let's try a little worm. Can you buy Bud Light at the store? Lol. They don't sell water. By the way, P.O. Box win? Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah. I gotta do that. Ooh, look at the boys over there. 
Hey, fellers. I think you want to do that and don't want to do it. I do want to do it. I just don't want to waste the time at the post office by their rules, man. Post office used to be cool, man. They've changed. The hell? Come here, pal. I'll do it, chat, but what's in it for me? <laughs> you guys are just going to send me, like, recipes that I won't be able to cook. Chat's going to send me recipes, like how when I give out game keys. YouTuber, here's the secret recipe for puffer fish. I've left out the thing you're supposed to cut out that'll poison you. Good luck. Tee hee. Like, oh, thanks. Wendy's gift card. No, don't do that. Well, all right. Maybe, maybe we'll uh, we'll do it as a member incentive thing too, where I do like a live unboxing. I mean, I'll do it anyway, but we'll just say, "Hey, you guys are great." Oops, wrong button. Would you consider playing Dinkum? It's basically Animal Crossing. I would. That's why I played it. Videos are on the channel. Uh, you'd send me salad? Uh, some of you can't be trusted. How about another Lego stream? Now that we could do. Well, we gotta set some real goals, though. First of all, I'm delivering on the incentives already from our previous member goal. But then we're going to have to find some stuff you guys really want to, like, drop member bombs for and really want to encourage everyone else to become members for. If we're going to go for an incentive. Otherwise, just know that becoming a member is also mostly a you thing, too, for all the extra cool stuff you get for being a member. But everybody gets free giveaways and stuff in the Discord just for being a subscriber. We gotta take her. We gotta take her. Come on, sir, right over here. Yeah! Hell yeah. Oh. Objects in the mirror are bigger than, are, well, smaller than they appear in this case. Uh, what's up, Roger? Welcome aboard, dude. That's the one's for you, man. A tiny one, but a good one. And worth 6 XP. So I can't really complain. Alright, let's see. Uh, oh, we're very close to level 3. Not too much further. Let's try the small boys again. These seem to bring in the most amount... In terms of, like, grinding and stuff, this is the better move for... Oops, that's the wrong one for this. But, um... This seems to be the better move just to kind of bring in the, bring in the money. Bring in the booty. Booty booty is important. Gotta have it. Can't live without it. Need that XP, need that money. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's teleport. Let's go to maybe area five. Yeah, I think I pulled the fish over the rock, but yeah. You want me to be your pen pal?
You would send me photos of people smiling with salad, yeah. I, yeah. I figured. Gamescom this week's gonna be interesting, yeah. I was hoping Buford had more time off so I could go, I wanna go. I wanna go. Oh, there we go. Nice. 17 XP. Very nice. Go on the sea, you'll get the big fish, true. True. Nice hit and a good. A new boy, a new challenger has entered the ring. Nice. A rainbow trout and a big boy, too. Worth a whopping 33. New personal record. Big dubs. All right. Very nice. 33 XP. That was a good one. Nice. Very good. And we got a skill point for that. Uh, let's see if we can spend that. W's in chat, yeah. Okay, let's see. When you reach a new level, the amount of time you earn extra coins is extended by 5%. You receive 5% more experience for each fish you catch. That one would be good. Increase the sale price of fish from the net and aquarium by 5%. Go with the grow and then, yeah, okay. These are going to be longer term perks, but at least we want the one that counts. First is catching them faster. Oh, I get rewards. Oh, I didn't know I had to click on that. Nice. Get more in 20 hours. All right, well, we got 231 bucks now, but still not enough to do much more. Gotta get level seven. Just start going for money now. That was a good spot. Hmm, biggest fish you caught was 130 pound sturgeon in the North Saskatchewan River of Alberta. The record is 230. Damn, dude, 230 pound sturgeon? Holy crap.
Wow. Poglad. Wait, where was I? I think I'm going to cast out this way. You caught a fish sandwich from McDonald's? Ooh, congratulations. 500 pound walleye. Sure. You caught a hundred pounder? Wow. I caught a uh, quarter pounder with cheese once. Very rare in these parts. Only available at participating locations. Oh, nice. Another big boy. Hell yeah, brother. All right, we found the sweet spot, ladies and gentlemen. This is where the big money is going to be made. Big money McGillicuddy. Hell yeah. That's the Masook spot. Oh, we got it now, boys. We got the meta. We got it. Oh yeah, they're just they're struggling. Struggling. Get it, get it, get it. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, careful there, Chief. Alright, not a new record, but f wait. That should be a new record. That's 42 XP. Oh, that's right, we earn more. Something. Or no, we're supposed to. Whatever. Um, I think I'm going to keep them now. And then we're going to... Let's put them in the aquarium. We're going to start a rainbow trout collection. Now that we can start actually getting some interesting fish. No trout about it, Chad. Okay. in for another kill. I think we went a little too far, though. Perfect spot. Oh. Oh, well. At least we get the XP. Actually, I, <laughs> I didn't even wait long enough to get the XP. I just threw him back. Angry. Get off my line. All right. Uh, is this the fishing game that's on sale in Steam currently? Yeah, this is on sale now. Uh, if you want to get this one. It is called Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2. Which is different than the one that uh, I'm also looking forward to, which is called The Angler uh, Call of the Wild. Which is from the makers of Hunter Call of the Wild, so it's going to be fun about fishing and such. Oh, sir, don't even. Oh, come on, where's the sweet spot? Thank you, Tan. You are the best. Wait, did you get off the line? Oh. Yeah, whatever. Come on now. Can you buy better fishing lures? Yeah. 
we've been buying... Well, it's not necessarily like... I mean, there's like different levels of it, but there's also different types too. Like there's some that are just better for other fish, like some that fish like more. Not like there's the best bait that attracts all fish. Kind of just bit, depends on the lake and the... What have you. Ooh, oh, come on, man. You again? Sir. Get over here. I'm gonna hit him like Scorpion in Mortal Kombat. Get over here. Nice. Alright. Well, we should at least get the XP. It'll add up. Get out of here, bird. These are my fish. Try to go a little higher this time. Oh, there we go. Nice. That's a good sound. Nice. Oh, and a new personal record. Baby, a big one. Very nice. Let's keep that bad boy, too. You're coming with me, sir. Very nice. Have I, any <laughs> Have I caught any goldfish crackers? Lol. Oh, chat. I love fishes because they're so delicious. The snack that smiles back. Yeah. Incoming bite in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Target locked. Go! Oh. I thought I could predict it, but I was wrong. I was so wrong. Oh, that, oh, the other fish was coming towards it. Oh, oh. Oh, that's unfortunate. I thought I hooked him. There we go. We came back for more. Yeah. <laughs> back for more. That's good. Let's start filling up the aquarium. Yeah, this is the sweet spot, for sure. Well, it's just the right right place, right lure. This feels right, you know? That was good, though.
Wait. I thought this was going to be a big fish. It looked big. Oh, it's nothing. Oh, man. Sometimes they look so misleading. Oh, this thing weighs less than the bait. Sir. Oh, he looked big. Eh, well. 3 XP. I'm going to drop him off at Long John Silver's. Back at it again. little fight in this one. It's all good. Just a itty bitty fight. A itty bitty bite. Oh. Oh my god, sir, are you okay? Sir? <laughs> eh. I want to have a whole tank full of bass. A twister tail? I've never heard of that. There's many, there's a few different countries and like tropical locations and stuff in this game. So there's like, I think there's saltwater fish in this game too. And probably rivers and ponds and small lakes and such, so. Here we go, brother, yeah. Alright, no more perch. No more bass. Give me a big O rainbow trout. 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 Let it all out. I think I gotta go up a little higher for those guys. Uh a grassy pickle again. Hello, sir. Nice to see you. Would you quit struggling? Thank you for the... Wow, whopping 6 XP. Now, this is the most fun so far. But it is supposed to be, uh... You know, a little, um... A little grindy for certain fish. You want me to try the new, the silver, silver, uh, lure? Yeah, I, I might need to use a different, uh, bait for, I mean, uh, maybe a different, uh, line for that? I'm not sure. There we go, we have the update in far th Farthest Frontier. Alright, Jack, can you confirm? Anybody update the update? Hold on, I got a big one. I mean, big is in certainly bigger than that grassy pickle. Oh, a bullhead. Well, that is a satisfying sound, though, when you toss that uh, that line out like that. Update to Farthest Frontier confirmed? All right, then that's what we're playing tomorrow. Should be good times, yeah.
wow. That was easy. Three XP. I can see the uh, the fellers and the guys there, the rainbows. At least the bullhead didn't swallow your bait. They always swallow mine. Oh, they're horrible. Just a vacuum. Let's try to stay up a little higher. We want to aim for this log, I guess, right here. But the big boys aren't going to see us unless we use that spinner bait, or the uh, spoon. The Spoonie McSpooner spoon. All right, let's try to do that. Uh, I love you, Raptor, but your stream is becoming a Farthest Frontier stream. Yeah, but right now we're not playing that. Every night in the PM, I play something different. And tomorrow we're going to play Farthest Frontier, but then we're going to go into a... Um, and do something a little different. We're going to watch a, a live stream of uh, Gamescom and such, or like pre-Gamescom hype. We're going to take a look at the uh, games coming out soon. You'll love it, chat. You'll love it. Didn't even see a single trout. Let's do it again. Looks like they're over here. You vote, I play whatever I want. Well, I'm really loving Farthest Frontier with you guys, but I'll eventually get bored of that, but it hasn't happened. But it's a mutual thing, like when you're bored and I'm bored, we move on to something else. You get bored, I try something new if I get bored. Ever try Soul Survivor? No. Hang on, and that was posted August 18th. Uh, yeah, the news of the update may have been. I'll take a look afterwards. If not, you know, like, we'll, I'm going to keep playing every day, so it's not like we're going to miss it. We'll see it the day it comes out. Oh, here we go. We're in the right spot. Where are you?
Yeah, a lot of you guys are here all the time, no matter what we do. It's awesome. But we got the best community in the world. We can I can literally just like uh I don't know, go go to the grocery store and you guys would be interested. I gotta visit uh, more European countries too, and more more events and more of Asia too. Any places to go. They're just mocking me at this point. Every time Yeah, Gamescom. Yeah, I want to do Gamescom. Well, I was gonna, I was thinking about it, and then you know, like Pinto couldn't go, and Bradford, and I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna have to go places all alone. Gonna be like the movie theater all over again. What about Bradford visiting? Yeah, he wants to come on the thirtieth, and stay until the second. So. He's coming over, I guess. All right, we should be in the right spot. Ideally, I need to I need to cast past this area, like further that way. I sure do sound excited. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. Having to take time off and not play games. I'm so thrilled. It's gonna be so amazing. I can't wait. I think the log is right about there. Let's let's cast on this side of the log. What's up, Ty? Good to see you. have to go outside too? Disgusting. Now it's hard to get the right speed for this one. It's a good lure, but the speed sucks. Do they mock me? Alright, that's it. Every time I cast out there, those fish are like, they only come after I cast. Every time. Maybe we could buy a new lure. Let's, uh, let's, let's try something new. Okay, let's try. Well, let's see. Level 2, green, yellow, red. Now let's try this. It's like in between. Oh, the thirteen dollar looks good for the next map. It could. We're getting some pretty decent fish, though. Like, we got to master these lures, though, because it's like. These are where the real money's gonna be made. We just gotta kinda master how to do it. Oh, here we go. 
Okay, now I might need to change the line a little bit. Yeah, that's right, damn it. Oh, boy. Woo! That's right. We got to take her. Hell yeah, brother. Come on, sir. Oh, that was a big one, too. Ooh. That was exactly what we wanted. A big boy, hell yeah, yeah, aw awesome, yeah, great photo, yeah. <laughs> I can't catch a break for nothing. Come on, man. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Okay, uh, that's a keeper. All right. Now we're getting the big boys. Living the dream, boys. Hell yeah, brother, brother. Yeah, yeah, brother, yeah. Fishing is like a washing machine for your brain. Abraham Lincoln, 1971. Come on, fella, right over here, you know you want it. Okay, so the sweet spot is about 22% there. Alright, so that's what we're going to do. So it's about a 22%. That's pretty speedy, but that means it's going to get rid of all those slow boys. Only turbos. Turbo trout. Get a hit. Perfect form, but nobody was around. Oh, that was very nice. Damn. Go a little bit more to the right. Very satisfying, man. Very satisfying. Dirty water equals bright and vibration baits. Interesting. I gotta let this thing fall a lot deeper.
Can I put weights on it? Um, I think the leader does that. Big hit, nice, there he is. And that is a nice sound. And we have a fighter. Pretty good fighter. Not bad, sir. And a new personal record. Hell yeah, brother. Well, that's nice. Into the pole again. A stock, a sockeye. Keep these boys. Yeah, it was a good run. Uh, let's go. I want to check the house. So let's see, like, do we actually have those in the aquariums now? Like, I want to see how we can. Uh. Go to residence. There we go. Wait. I think I had to check the uh, the net. Sell or release. Add to aquarium. Add to trophies. Show in 3D. How come I can't add these? Wow, fifteen dollars for this sockeye. Two stars, not bad for like, you know, the initial starting area with basic stuff. Oh, we can feed the fish. Where are they at? Oh, there we are at three. Oh. Cool. There they go. Enjoy, boys. Oh, we can add some to trophies if we want to. Feed lifetime, okay. So we can actually like feed them more. So if we come back and feed these guys continuously, they'll grow and then they'll probably be worth more money if we take care of them. That's kind of cool. I don't know why I can't add more to aquarium though. Maybe they'll fight or something. Or maybe you can only have three at a time. Oh, 
Oh, one of each type of fish? Maybe. Let's just sell and get money. We'll get way more of these boys now that we've found the winning combo. We found the sweet spot, and we found a good, a damn good lure for that area. Let's just get money. We'll come back and check on these guys later. Now, it seems to auto-assign the fish to each tank. Well, let's go back to that sweet spot. <sighs> then we need to, like, afford probably a better, uh... If we're going to use that spooning, the yellow... Well, wait, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. What if we go to the other lake? Let's go to the other lake and try that. Spinner baits and crank baits on largemouth, yeah. We're gonna need like a probably a new reel to go for it. Eh, go to the big dock. You know what that uh the, the hiding in the bush emote would also be good as like a little blanket too. Like when we get closer to winter, we'll have it be our cozy emote. Well, instead of making it a bush, we'll just turn it into like a little cozy blanket. That'll be cool. You think we're going to get a gator? Gator raid. Dinner's over here, boys. Oh, we gotta take her. Maybe. Nope. Well, we got a little bit of attention. Yeah, the bait here is gonna have to be really good. We got pretty close, though. Uh, chat? I'm getting word you have a, uh... Update to your favorite emote. Yeah, the water here is murky. It's gonna be hard for them to see it, I think. Blueberries. Why, look at that. The secret of the blueberry bush. Thank you, Art, dude. I'm going to let this thing sink all the way to the bottom. Well, worst case scenario, we go back to the other spot because that was at least generating some good coin.
Hey, fellers. Looking like a snack over here. Pha! Just passed right through one. No, didn't even care. Yeah, there's a live bait option. Ugh. All right, all right, let's go with something else. Chat, what would you recommend for these waters? Kind of murky. Oh, what do we have? We have $248, so we really can't do much other than bait and lures. Ooh, a cherry. Grenade. Yeah. Okay. Whatever spinning. Riding the spinners, they don't stop. Worms for worky, murky water. Okay. Oh my god, shrimp. Oh hell yeah. Never mind. Let's just buy that and we'll go home. $60 for shrimp. <laughs> Look, chat, no hands. Wow. That is breakdancing shrimp. Is it going to stop or what? I think I think we've actually broken the space-time continuum. Wait, is it is it slowing down? Oh, it's slowing down. Now that's a spinner bait right there. You think earthworms? Okay. All right. Wow. That was that was something. Okay. Let's do that. What was that? Oh, hooks. Oh, we get different types of hooks too. All right. Let's do. Wait. First of all. Oh, wait. If we're just gonna do um. What is it? Shouldn't this be enough then? Just I think we have it set to like a meter, like one point seven meters or something. Yeah, let's just try this. Sure. Ooh. Wait a minute. Oh my god. The distance that he can cast the... Uh, this one versus the other one is crazy. Live action. go oh, oh pal oh, I I left click before right click my bad I didn't deserve that I, I didn't earn it but that was good fish though prove that it works okay he's back for more all right you're coming with me pal holy F whoa Beep, pew damn it pew These guys don't mess around. Phew. How was that? Wait, what?
All right, well, at least it was set right, so we're good. Now he's got to be... Got to get good at games now. I have to like put my hand in a completely different spot for this type of fishing. There we go. Boss battle. I don't know if I can move while he's close to the dock. I should be able to go get him at the edge. These fish is going to die of old age. Come on, man. Sir.
Are you... Sir. Yeah, at this point, we may as well just jump in. <sighs> so anyway, Chad, how's your day? How's, how's your Monday going? Anybody having a good day? One's in the chat if you're, if you're having a good day. How y'all doing? Welcome. Thanks for coming out to the Big O stream. A lot of nail-biting, hot fish in action. White hot, super crazy, man. Wow. Insanity. All right, now I'm, th I'm suspecting we might have a fish on the line. I'm not entirely sure. Let's check. I think we do, yes. I believe that... Upon its uh, second inspection, does appear to be a fish. A very pissed off fish. I, just, I, <laughs> I need someone else to jump in multiplayer to go to the other side of the uh, lake and just hit him with a rock. He's like, he's at the opposite side of the lake now. in there and getting his ass right now. Dick! Alright, whatever. Not mad. Not mad. The duck you looking at, pal? That's what I thought. Well, like the strongest line we had. I guess we're going to have to buy a new one. A better one. We're going to have to buy the tree fitty. Wait, wait, wait. Was there another one in there? <sighs> Let's see. Wait. 
I need to buy a fish bait. Oh, you get you get ten for seven bucks. Okay. Just buy a harpoon. Yeah. Okay. This should be all set now. Okay, let's make sure this is set up right. Okay, looks good. Oh good, we caught, caught the ground. Hunting bears, actually. I love you, how you cast into the bush. I was uh, equipping a new bait, blueberries. Uh, oh, there we go. Wait, it won't let me cast anymore. Why? That's weird. It won't let me do like a gentle cast, it has to be like a crazy long range cast. Over here, sir. Has anyone seen my pack of dynamite? I'm going to let Rap give it a go after noodling. I need a tactical nuke.
So now suddenly we up upgrade to a different uh, type of string and then suddenly not interested. Interesting. Everybody suddenly become, uh, oh. There we go. Not this time, pal. Got a tow rope on here. No escape. Yeah. Nice. A common bream. Good. Get out of here, duck. There's so many good fish around here. Can you put your fish... Can you put fish you catch in the aquarium? Yeah. Yeah, you can. It's pretty cool, actually. Then you can take care of them and, and like, uh, if you catch them and put them in your aquarium, you can have them grow. And then you can release them back into the, uh, back into the lakes later for more XP. So if you catch a little one and if you're patient, you can grow it into a big one and then release the uh, fish into a much larger fish. It's pretty cute. You thinking about it, pal? Come on over. Dinner is served. Whoa, that was the fastest! Whoa! Oh, come on, I right clicked, pal. That was the fastest moving fish ever. Did you guys see that? I hope none of you blinked. Whoa! Wow. Jeez. Oh, there we go. That's, that's revenge. Ooh. This fish is going to be a heavy one. Hefty. With a capital heft. Probably going to be at what? Is that another common bleak? Bream? Whatever it is? Sure. You come over here, please. Thank you. Oh, a trench! Or a te tench! Oh. Wow, that's a big boy. 2.47. Hell yeah. Brother, yeah. Keep that one. Hell yeah. That was a damn fine catch. If I do say so myself. Ew. That one got mad. He got real mad. Any takers? Oh yeah. No. Maybe. Oh boy. Oh. That's a big one.
Hold the line. Well, we're eating tonight. Yeah, this line was a good buy. I guess it's all about knowing when to upgrade and what the fish weights and stuff are. It'd be kind of helpful with an encyclopedia. Come here, you. Nice. A barbell. Two awesome new fish. Hell yeah. 3 kg, 64 centimeters long. Very nice. And a level up. Damn. Woo. Hell yeah. Wow. Very nice. Do we get a new skill point? You should get a new skill point every level. But I guess some of the skill points must be really good. Let's go back to the back to the menu. All right, that's a that's a good fishing spot. That's a good setup. That's a damn good setup. That's gonna be some good money. Uh, let's see. Oh, I want to get those other fish out of there. Thirty three and ten bucks, and those are just like basic fish. Nice. We're level five. Bum, bum, bum. Wow. Go fishing, hell yeah. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. How do you know when you like what the next level gives? Oh, this is only early access. Not bad. Oh yeah. Ultimate fishing simulator two early access. I guess I didn't read the giant you know, early access thing up at the top. Oh, well, it's easy to miss. Oh, boy. Speaking of miss, chat, make sure you don't miss our next live stream tomorrow for Farthest Frontier. Perhaps the update will be out. We'll see what happens. So uh, thank you, everybody, for spamming that like button, and thank you, everybody, for hanging out. Uh, this game's great. We're going to compare this to, um, you know, this is great, but will uh, the next game be better? The Angler Call of the Wild? We're going to try that one uh, next week, then, when that one comes out, too, but... Uh, Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2, super chill, fun that you can actually like do tournaments, make money that way, and uh, some pretty locations and interesting mechanics to like figure things out by uh, figuring out the lures, but more importantly, like where, kind of scouting out by fishing where the fish are, and then like finding out how to get them by like trying to hunt for them, if you know what I mean. So that was cool. All right, guys, thank you very much for being here. Fish are awesome, by the way, and fishing is really cool, as well as conservation of. Uh, those environments and such. So consult your local library, I guess, for more or whatever. I don't know. Go to a, go to a museum. All right. I'm going to go grab some food and get some videos ready for you all tomorrow, including a video on Sengoku. So I will uh, see you all then. Yes, we will be doing some more raids in the future. YouTube is doing some uh, fixing to their system to make it a little bit easier. So I'm going to raid myself for tomorrow's stream for the next couple of uh, streams until YouTube uh, does some things that they promised they would make changes to to make it a little easier to raid channels that are up and coming. I hope to see you all tomorrow, and thank you very much for watching. Take care, chat. You're the best. Have a good one, folks. Thanks for hanging out. Good to see you all in the chat again.